Hello guys, and welcome to part 4 of our 100% walkthrough The Shadow of the Earth Tree uh, We're gonna go for the catacombs Also, another cave no, I actually wanted to do the cave first, but you know Like the catacombs kinda like over here It's not in the map, but uh, you know, it is a kinda closed area Right there, right, yeah so I'm gonna do it real quick and it's of course it's in the graveside plains. Like still not did not move to the second location of the uh, DLC. Otherwise you're gonna see it in the title. But yeah, uh, the catacombs kinda in front of us. Grab the butterfly. I'm gonna grab these like on our way. There is I believe uh, something stone here or somber, I believe. It, I think it's level four. Oh, level three. You know these guys for now. I'm gonna deal with them later. So basically, just go in a straight line. Can't open my map to show you where we are at. There you go. See, just in straight line, all the way here. Gonna keep going straight uh, because I know uh, this catacomb is uh, not easy. It is annoying. Bunch of new enemies. And we all know the enemies of the catacombs, one of the, like, they are so annoying. Plus, uh, there is uh, some good stuff in here. If you love uh, the hatches, or you can, uh, you can the dual axes, we're gonna get a really, really good one here. Not good, not only good, cool as well. And we're gonna get an incantation, we're gonna get a summon, as well as... Oh, it's called the talisman. But yeah, let's rest up and begin our journey. Uh, we're gonna use one sword. We don't need to use two swords because the enemies here are pretty fast and pretty annoying. You can see they are new. Uh, they can't. Oh my god. Uh, they can drop their weapon. Come on, dude. We're gonna do a reset. That's just a waste for our health. Uh, but they can drop this summon, it's called the uh, Serpent Greatsword, I believe. You know what, let's just spam. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. For that. Because uh, this catacomb is kind of long and I'm gonna try... ...to finish it... ...without uh, dying. I'm gonna change you. Drop on this one, that's gonna... Uh, ...gonna restore more health now. Bro! Can you not? Get the hell out of my face, boy! So annoying. Anyway, grab the grave globert. Let's get one step and go back. There you go. Now we're gonna go to the left. Get a little bit. Excuse me. Excuse me. He's dying. Oh my god. I hate him. I hate him so much, brothers. I really do. I thought he didn't die. Sure, I at least leveled up, man. Oh well. It's all good. And let's go over here. Ignore this dude. We can't do much about him right now. Although there is. This brother. He's dead. Nice. Now I'm gonna go straight line. And there's cannon guy. Can I actually make you fall? Yep, we did. Nice. I actually want to heal. Hold on. See these guys. Of course, they do ridiculous amount of damage. Uh, we're gonna go up there in a little bit. There's nothing there, but I'm gonna show you. Uh, there's another cannon guy on the left here. Try to ambush us. I'm gonna take him down. Another dude on this corner. You can see him there. Looking in the shadows, take him down and grab the Ancient Dragons and Knight's Cookbook. Now we're gonna head on this way. As you can see, and as you thought, we can go over it. So we're gonna do this. Now you can't get bugged. I did get bugged over here and got uh, uh, and uh, got stuck. Died, of course. Oh, this guy's kind of annoying, so we're gonna get rid of him. Oh, missed me. 
Bad aim, brother. Bad aim. Unfortunately for you. Grab the resin. A little more. He's... What's up, buddy? What are we doing? You're gonna make it. Yeah, I think I had the time. I don't know. Reddins. Take him down. Gonna get our revenge from this dude. What's up, buddy? Get him down as well. And we're gonna continue. A big fight over here. It's three knights. Guarding the big knight there. The summon that we can get is for the black knight there. There you go. There's another dude on our left. Try to ambush us. So we're gonna jump, take him down real quick. Oh, touch me. Oh, he did. Hold on. Hold on, let me hit. Thank you. That was not cool from you, bro. Really not. Come on. Come on. There you go. Good boy. Put him down. Grab the blossom. Boom. Awesome. Here. Grab the Globerts level 10. Now I can upgrade my teach. And we're gonna head on here. Wait to drop. Gonna make it. Unfortunately. Now we did. Nice. Now we're gonna roll over here. You. This is our summon, our spirit dash. Black Knight Commander Andreas. This is where we just for the night. So we are basically good, ladies and gentlemen. Let's continue our way back now. Should I drop down? Nah. We're really actually afraid I get bugged. Let's hope not. We actually dropped down, but... I get bugged like right here. Nice. So what are we gonna do? I'm gonna drop down and go backwards. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Ooh, maybe. Nice. We have left. Thank you very much. So, taking this ladder, gonna lead us to where we got the cannon guy. That we backed up and let him drop. I'm gonna show it to you to fulfill your curiosity. I know you're curious. And, oh, that's a uh, long ladder. And, there's nothing here. Just this. But yeah. So we're shooting at us, we're there. Get your revenge if it didn't, if it didn't drop for you. Give me. And that's not an illusionary wall. You can see that here. Illusionary wall there? No, it's not. And now let's go to the next floor. Then yeah, we're doing pretty good. I got line. This is uh, really nice. There's nothing there as well. And uh, now if we die, it's all good because we have the stake of America. We don't want to die. Not planning to die, but you know. Sometimes it happens. It's a bunch, a bunch of these dudes. So do I have hold on? Oh yeah, actually sorry, nice. Come on. Come on. That's... Oh well, that worked for us. Let me put a throwable here. 
in case. Oh, I don't have any? Really? Uh, of course I do. Okay, nice. There should be another one to the left. Boom! We'll have one more attack. It's gonna get, uh, there's an enemy gonna drop you. Look at me, bro. He doesn't worth your sacrifice. I don't know why my guy didn't use his ability for some reason, but... He doesn't deserve it. Sacrificing for a freaking skeleton. I mean, it's alive, dude. Oh, yeah. Anyway. This is done. We're gonna go <clears throat> to the right. <clears throat> Pardon me. I need to drink some water, dude. Uh, first thing we're gonna do... Is this. Now we're gonna go to the left. There's an enemy gonna drop. You can see him over there. It's a boot. Now you got this rat, not me. No trigger. Now we're gonna go to the left and drop down. There he is, there he is. No, please, no! Oh well. I really hate these things. From Dark Souls, I hate them. I'm gonna go to the left. There should be two enemies yet, so they are on this side. Two of these guys that you're gonna get rid of. Uh, if my guy keep. Oh, man! I gotta tell you. Why I can't move front, please? I think I'm just bad, guys. I think I am. Anyway, uh, we're then down. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the electro charge. This looks pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you, I did not use or tried any incantations or spells. I am a melee guy. Uh, I just, and no, if, uh, no offense to all the mages. Uh, they should know faith users. I don't like uh, using magic. Only a melee magic. Melee magic. And melee is my favorite, so yeah. That's not gonna be a good guide if I'm just like standing here and the enemy's there. I'm just throwing magic at him. For my melee boys and girls. It's not a good guide. Anyway, uh, this is what we killed the, the dude there. When I said he does not deserve sacrificing your life and that stuff, blah blah blah. Now we're gonna go back. Still four more enemies. That guy's actually a good sniper, I ain't gonna lie. Come on. There you go. The jar dude. Now we're gonna make a run for it. Hold on, hold on. That's shot. Now we're gonna make a run for it. What's up, buddy? Alone. Lurking in the shadows. Two, three, only four. Oh my god, I forgot about this. Oh, I'm just dumb. I scared the hell out of me. I can't lie, but. But take him down. Grab yourself. A nice Shadow Realm room. Take this dude down. I actually see them, so then there's no point coming to the first actually. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are ready for the boss. The boss is awesome. Goals are Death Knight. We're gonna grab his weapon. And if you fight him one on one, he's pretty tough. I ain't gonna lie. He's pretty, pretty tough. He can actually have a combo, like when he spins. That can one hit kill you. So you gotta be really careful. Of course, we are gonna use a summon because this is a guide. But for you, if you wanna try 1v1 him, you gotta be careful. Plus, he can grab you and restore his health. So it's not easy. 
Not easy boss at, boss at all. Even with the summon he's killed. Because I was reckless. Give my stuff back. Mm. Nice. Nice. Ugh. But yeah, uh, now he's gonna try to grab me, I believe, so I'm gonna heal. That's the grab attack. Do not get hit by it. He's gonna sell all of his health. And of course, he's gonna receive a ridiculous amount of damage. That's the combo that I was talking about. That one hit kill you. You gotta be careful. <clears throat> Late man, slow. This also can one hit kill you. Unfortunately, I died by this one. No, don't grab my mimic. Oh my god, he grabbed it. That's annoying. But as you can see, it's actually pretty good that he grabbed my mimic. So you guys, you get to see it. Oh, I thought my mimic gonna let him fall down. Okay. Thank you. A boy! A boy! No, no, get out! Get away from me! Ooh. <laughs> so scary, dude. So scary. Come on, hit him. There you go. My turn. Come on, your turn. Go ahead. Never mind, I'll take him down. But yeah, he's so scary, man. The Death Knight's Win Axe and the Crimson Amber Medallion plus 3. One of my favorite medallions, I love them. No, increase your HP from 1975 to 2173. Basically about 300. 300? 200. So it's not bad at all. Plus let me show you what the X can do. Put this one on. Look at this. Move. You press L2 and R2. Man, don't tell me that ain't cool, but that's cool as hell, bro. I gotta try them. I didn't, never tried them, though. Anyway, that done. The catacomb is officially done. Now. We're gonna go all the way over here. Gonna make a good run with the horse. Let me actually upgrade, <clears throat> upgrade myself a little bit. Don't want to upgrade. I mean, gotta do it. Go ahead. Uh, but yeah. So basically there's two ways to go down, either from here, you go all the way back and come back here. Or <clears throat> you can go from this side and jump down and go down. <clears throat> we're, gonna, we're gonna go through this, there is a cave over here, there is one of the best medallions, <clears throat> pardon me, one of the best medallions in the game, which is the Twin Green Total Talisman, and everybody knows this is one of the best talismans in the game, so, so yeah. Let's go. And we're gonna fight bunch, bunch, bunch of these like fat big enemies. We're gonna see in, a, in an our way. Like when I say bunch, it's like about 16, 15 enemy in one place. You're gonna see it in a little bit. Uh, but we're gonna make the run. I also wanna use you. Let me put this and the Crimson Medallion, it's gonna increase my health. Oh my god. I'm not gonna die? I ain't gonna die like this, brothers. Holy, that's a lot. <clears throat> that's a lot of health. I'll take it. Holy, look at my health bar, brothers. I, that, that's these guys that, uh, that I'm talking about. 
But anyway, we're gonna take the left side. Gonna try this. The build that... Just heal you up. I don't think you're gonna die. At least not against the bosses. Try card stuff and this. Man, this is gonna be a beautiful build. Which uh, that leads me to. Do you guys want me like to change builds during the walkthrough? I cannot stick into one build. Uh, but uh, that's gonna be not gonna use an incantations or spells that hit from far away. I said that's gonna not gonna be guide. It's just gonna be me standing. No offense, of course. Standing in a place and shooting the enemies from far away. So yeah. And when you see this. <clears throat> that's the shack over there. Uh, we're going to go left. We're going to drop down here. We have marked on the minimap to be honest with you. I think it's going to be good. Actually, not uh, that hot. And this is the, the item over here. No, it's not. Like, on the way, there's no really good items. All of them are sambars and that stuff. And these things that you do not need. But yeah, I was talking about the build. I want me to change builds. Like, for example, doing the build that in my mind. I want that to increase health and that stuff. With this. I know Rikard's great so one also give you health when you defeat enemies, but I like this one better. Plus a little bit of change. Everybody using Rikard and uh, Godric. Grab their Vert Spirit Ash. Degrees. Now you might be a little bit confused, like what? We started from here and what? So basically we went to over here. So the right side went like this, and then we went back like this. So we went in a big circle. On this, this. If you, if you kinda like kinda lost when you see when you get over here, you see the two flowers, just take left and you're gonna reach this place. Now with this done. We can actually go left. And that's gonna take us all the way over here. Which is gonna be for not this episode, maybe the next or the one after. And for now, we just wanna go and finish the cave. Grab the twin, turtle, medallion, and we are gonna be good. Uh, take down these rats. You might ask why, because we're gonna fight that uh, root. Big monster, I don't know what to call. We're gonna fight him in a little bit, like in front of us there. This guy is gonna follow you. Uh, uh, excuse me? Excuse me? I'm sorry. Excuse me? Thank you. What am I using? Oh, yeah, we're using this one. I'm using this, this. Come on, pop off. Let me take you down. There you go. Oh, buddy. Come on. Actually, we're not gonna use this. This is gonna do much, much more damage. I thought he grabbed me for a second.
I'm done with yours, ladies and gentlemen. You're gonna give us a the armed bear. And some of that you can use to throw some stuff. The enemies. And there's gonna be a bunch, bunch of these guys that we all gonna ignore. And uh, now we're gonna take, uh, I believe, right. There, there it is. Grab our loot. Gimme, gimme. Thank you. Gonna continue forward all down uh, the way to the end. Well, if we take him down, I am good. I have 900, I need to spend these. Uh, is it on this way or what's not? It's after the crap, yeah. You can see this giant crab? Go to the waterfall. Don't look at me, please. Thank you. Get inside. You can see this old dog. I'm actually a turtle. The two-headed turtle talisman. I said one of the best. I want to open my map. Let me take down these guys. I'll show you where we guys at. You're not gonna get confused. Though you can't go wrong with the the turtle. This month. Well, this is always good. There you go. We're basically over here. What we did from our grace, we took it all the way. <clears throat> Just ran past through everything and went over here. The cave is gonna be like kinda over here, so we're just gonna go out. Move that one, which where is it? This other one. The same direction? Or this one? So after you exit the waterfall, stick to the right side, it should be over here. There it is. By the way, do not underestimate the wolves that are here. They do be, be doing a lot of damage. They come real quick and real fast. Can outplay you, and you can see that's just one hit, and they are pretty fast. So, be careful. Don't tell me I didn't say it to you. I did. I did indeed. And from here, okay, <clears throat> there's another wolf that tried to ambush us, so we can hit him from this side. And the booty. Hey, your friend died. You're gonna do nothing. Grab the meats. East bones. Shouldn't be about three or four wolves here. Down real fast. There you go. Uh, we're gonna jump there in a little bit. There's a big wolf there. Uh, but now we're gonna jump over this side. And drop down. Ladies and gentlemen, look at this. Let me show you. Look at that, man. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and another guy over here. 15 enemy of these dudes. I don't know. If, I lost count. Maybe 16. I don't know. That much. That's, uh, that's actually a lot of these dudes. So, yeah. Really a lot. Oh. There's a big wolf here, uh, the white one. It's kind of a little bit annoying. What? There's a wolf on the right. I want it down first. There you go. That's me and you. Buddy. 
There you go. I'm done. Grab the sacred bloody full flesh. And if you continue all the way, <clears throat> that's gonna take us back. We're gonna drop down again. And drop down again. Just have to make sure there's nothing there. But <clears throat> I will take down these guys simply by lowering them over here and spam your ability to for the best. I actually can't kill him. Hold on. We cannot ever get down. No, 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 no. If I put my, uh, my talisman, I think I can kill him with one jump attack. But I don't want to risk it. We're going healthy. You should get back up. Put the one behind and boom. Oh, the thumb, nice. And nice. There you go. Come on. Go. One your left. Can you see there, buddy? Him down as well. There you go. Oh, There's still a lot, you know, got that. I should have aimed for the, the dude. Whoa, 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 By the way, the boss is one bigger one of them. We did all that. For one that piece of loot on the, there, you can see it on the left. Uh, is it worth it? I'm gonna say to you. But taking them all down. Grab the umbrellas and reveal the loot. Hold on. Reveal the loot. It is Sacred Bloody Flesh. Thanks, back down. <laughs> for real, dude. All this for a freaking advice kid. <clears throat> Let's go to the boss. Boss itself is not that hard. He can be a little aggressive, but not really that hard. Come on, boy. Get him. Yeah. Come on, boy. You did touch my boy. I mean, I guess. It's pretty easy. Chief Bloodfeet. There you go. How much we are? I... 55 minutes, actually, not a lot. Hmm, the problem is actually, by the end of this episode, I was not planning to do more. It's all good though, because, <clears throat> you know. The problem is, see, if. Let's remove this first. If we were to run to this area, we will not be able to get a grace until like over here. We're gonna like we have to run out from one of these fire golems that we fought and kind of stuff as well. So it actually doesn't make sense for me just to run and hit the, <clears throat> hit the grace. Plus, I still. Uh, do not know if I'm gonna do this area first or uh, the castle. I'm leaning towards the castle, but we'll see. But all of this uh, gonna be in the next episode. For now, we are done. So.
yeah, as always, drop a like, subscribe if you find it enjoyable and useful. I will love you forever. And yeah, see you guys in the next one.